Welcome back to Living Inuit. The Hawaii Food and Wine Festival 2024 coincides with Chef's Weeks, uh, which starts today. Uh, the details right now we're going to get from the festival. CEO Denise Yamaguchi and Namikaze Executive Chef Jason Peel joining us. Thank you guys for being here. Appreciate it. Yeah, thank, thank you, you for having us. us. This is awesome. Um, okay, so Chef's Week, uh, the festival. You guys are busy. Yeah, this, we're is, busy. this is good stuff. Tell, uh, tell us a little bit about um, what's going on. So we're excited to bring Chef's Week to the community in anticipation of the 14th annual Hawaii Food and Wine Festival. You know, when we started the festival back in 2011, uh, we actually were early. We were actually at the end of September and um, beginning of October, but now the festival has moved back all the way to late October, early November okay. because the shoulder season got shorter. But with the wildfires and the pandemic, you know, our shoulder season has crept up now to like actually right after Labor Day. Mm -hmm. And so we've launched Chef's Week to support our local restaurants who are you know, during this critical period where the visitor industry generally slows down. Mm -hmm. And um, we're looking for the community to come out and support our local restaurants and participating talent. I'm trying to spark it back to life, I love yep. that. Um, what, what can we expect when we attend? So when you, attend, when you come to Chef's Week, there's 50 participating restaurants. And when you get there, there'll be one of these wrap cards, a check stuffer, and you'll find a QR code or you'll find it like that, mm -hmm. but on that little card. Okay, yep. yeah. And um, when you scan it, you'll find it'll unlock a promo code. Mm -hmm. And when you, uh, the promo code will then give you access to a priority ticket for a general admission price. Okay. It's a hundred dollar value. For that priority access, you get an hour early entry. You get to interact with the chefs in a much more intimate way, and you get first dibs on everything. Mm -hmm. So this promo code unlocks um, the special um, opportunity yeah. for. The Lucky Dragon okay. at the Mauna Kea Beach Resort, um, Vida Lavino at the Sheraton Maui, Jade Cocktail Club at Alohilani, and Spice Market at Koolina. Ooh, that's a lot of yeah. good stuff. Um, it's really important to be able to hear from a, a, a chef who's kind of in the middle of all of this. <laughs> um, and so, Chef Jay, maybe you could tell us a little bit about what you guys need during this kind of a, what what Denise has explained as a slow period. Yeah, we, we've been we've been really lucky. The community has been a great support to us. But programs like this really helps to you know, get our name out there, get new people in. Mm -hmm. And, you know, it's, it's such a great, the festival is so awesome in um, supporting the schools, the farmers, even shows me new farmers that I want to use at the restaurant. So um, I just really appreciate the time and effort that it takes to do all of this stuff, so. I wanted to say, you're seeing video of your ribs right now. And let me just tell you firsthand that you guys served up ribs for the UCLA game for our ESPN Honolulu oh, crew. Yeah. And I absolutely went berserk. Those are <laughs> so good, by the way. Unreal. Uh, they ca we catered Namikaze, and it was really, really good. So thank you so much. But you, no, no. you did something here today. You brought some stuff. Tell us what you're doing today. So I just, so we, we love our farmers. I love the farmers. They work so hard for us in the community. And, you know, we really need to get more local products yeah. that come from Hawaii in Hawaii. So. Um, I got I got uh, okra from Mountain. Um, this is from Ahiki Acres. Okay. With some pickled radish. Let's see if they can see that. Okra. Can you see that? There, there you Beautiful Burmese okra. And then um, what did what? Sorry. I just put a little mushroom dashi in there. Okay. Um, we have some green onions and Thai chilies um, from Mountain View Dairy. We're gonna add that in there. So this is like one of my kind of like one of my favorite things to eat because I don't really like taco wasabi. Okay. <laughs> um, so I make a okra wasabi. Um, so, you know, traditional You're Japanese dish. You're really actually putting a lot of muscle into stirring this up. So we got to get it slimy. <laughs> got to get it all whipped up and okay, slimy. Just actually, you probably want to go faster since we're not much time. Did that okra do something to, like, <laughs> offend you? What's going on there? So we got a little bit slimy. Um, we move this one. Okay. And now we got some pickles. Have you had this? No, I haven't. Okay, so this some is pickle incredible. radishes. And I'm doing it really, oh, really rushed. We'll make it nicer at the restaurant, I promise. While he's doing that, um... Let's just give, go ahead and give everybody the information again on, on, on Chef's Week and the, the festival. Give everybody where we can find out more information to get tickets. So Chef's Week starts today, October 16th. It'll run to the 30th. Visit one of the participating restaurants. You can go to hawaiifoodandwinefestival.com mm -hmm. backslash Chef's Week. Okay. It will unlock a special promotion for our festival. It will give you actually an elevated experience if you use the code. You can get early access. And again, that um, our festival starts October 18th and ends November 15th. 10th. Okay. So. And they align in a really good way. Yes, because we're, we're here to support the culinary community. Perfect. And Chef, just yep. that was quick. You whipped up. So what is this dish? So this second one, so this is uh, right next to us in Kali. We have uh, Mrs. Chang's tofu. 
Oh, they work so hard down can, there. Can we see? I love them. How can we see that? Um, and then what? What and this then, goes with that? Ah, they're two separate dishes. Okay. We like to do tapa style, kind of izakaya. Nice. And then we got smoked tomatoes from Whole Farms, and then microgreens from Mari Garden. Are you gonna take a bite of that? So do you just slurp that up? How do you do that? Uh, yeah. What, what do you do with that? <laughs> well, it's very slimy. So what? Wait, you here, try. You, you, no, no, you go first. <laughs> you go first, quick. We're running out of time. Okay. Let's go. Go go go. Okay, you try that. I'll okay. try this. <laughs> you have to slurp it up. Because he said it's slimy. It is slimy. <laughs> Don't get it on your shirt. <laughs> Chef, uh, go ahead and give us your your site and for Namikaze. Tell us NamikazeHawaii.com. Okay. Check us out on our website. Come visit at the restaurant. Um, we have Okazuma coming up, Busubi Cafe, so um, and our bakery. My wife does a great job. <laughs> you know. you Got to plug the wife. That's yeah, really yeah. good. Gotta That's really good that you did that about that. Good stuff. Um, thank you guys for being here. Appreciate it. That is delicious. I'll try this during try the break, this. just in case it's a little too slim. No, no, I'm good. I'm good. <laughs> all, right. all right. All that information is going to be on our website, cage12.com. Just hit the Facebook, uh, the, the uh, Living Aid Wait tab, and we'll have all that information and links to them as well. Thank you guys. Appreciate it.